All right, I got lots of questions on my post about these new carbon fiber shift links. So we're gonna do a test today on them. Chain around a rock, one ton load cell, and then going up there, attached to the back of the car. So as soon as this gets a zero on it, so here we go, zeroed out, nice and stable. Back up here so we can see everything. All right. All right, so there we are, over 200. That's our uh, chain shifting on the rock over there. So real quick, show you we still don't have any slipping on the links here. So those jolts were, uh, they were not failures. Keep going. There's 800. I think we're actually gonna, we're losing the bolt there on the end. We still haven't lost anything. We actually uh, broke the rock. <laughs> so let's go ahead and we'll keep pulling that. We'll get it back up there to the uh, tension where we were. There's 1,200 pounds. Go ahead and put another click or two on there. So there we are, we're over 1,500 pounds on this now. Uh, kind of getting to the point where I think this is almost a, I'm debating whether it's worth continuing. Let's get one more click on it. All right, so there's you can see right there as the numbers are rolling. We actually broke 1600 for a second. The, uh, the LED display kind of makes it hard to read what it's saying. But uh, static at over 1500 pounds. Over 1530, it actually blinked over 1600 there for a second. And you can see the aluminum plate on the end is completely failing. It's trying to rip the bolt through the end of it. And uh, not broken yet. And this is actually the same one that I did the, uh, the load test in the, uh, the other video that I'll attach with this one. I'll actually be part of the same video where I, I hung 40 pounds off the side of this thing. So this is the same shift link that was tested in a, uh, a lateral load and now we're stretching it. So there you go. Over 1500 pounds, no failure yet. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna call it there. I don't really see much point in continuing any further in that.